Hello guys and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today I'm going to walk you through how to connect your Xbox 360 receiver adapter to Windows 10. As for me, I bought this recently. I uh, didn't know how to do it, but finally figured it out. So firstly, when I go into settings, I look at it and it writes unknown device, driver is unavailable. So there's no way of connecting to your controller. Once you click on it, so as you could see, it writes unknown device, driver is unavailable. So I can't connect my controller towards it. So once you click on the thing, you go up to devices and printers. As you can see, it shows me everything that I have that's connected to the computer. You go down and you write unspecified unknown device. You right click and you go to properties. As for this, you go hardware. From there you go hardware. Then you press properties. And from this, just don't worry about going to drivers, details and events. Just go to change settings. As you change settings, you look at it and then after you just go to general you leave it like that general and you got update driver instead of searching online you go to browse my computer and then after you'll go let me pick from a list of unavailable available drivers on my computer once you click on this it will show you every single driver you have on this computer so you need to scroll for look for thoroughly and see where you writes Xbox 360 so once you click on this you just double click or next and after you look you try to look at what version your computer is running so for me it's on Windows 10 so I go up to Xbox 360 wireless receiver for Windows 10 so I click on it and after you just accept press yes and after you receive it so you press close close everything you don't really need it so as I go down it says Xbox 360 wireless receiver so now go up to my device that I just plugged into the computer, the receiver. Press on the middle button and on your Xbox 360 controller, press your pair button, hold it. One of the logo on the top left side lights up. Then it will just show you that it's been connected. So for me, it's been connected. So Xbox 360 control, wireless controller and Xbox 360 wireless receiver. So basically, that's how you make it paired pair your device to Windows 10 and yeah if you like the video please leave a like and subscribe